right? I'm not going to say what. I'm not going to, like, start pulling up screenshots or anything. And he apologized to me. And so, like, I really didn't want to cut Seth off because, um, like, so from my perspective, Seth and I were, like, good friends, right? And, I mean, I have, like, okay, so there have been tons of people in my personal life and people professionally who have been, like, um, yeah, you know, I don't, I don't really like Seth. Uh, or, you know, like, are you cool with this thing that Seth did or whatever? And every time uh, this would happen, I would always defend him. I would be like, no, look, you know, A, B, or C, X, Y, or Z, like something, right? Like, I, you know, I, I defended Seth, like, to the death. You know, anytime anybody I knew had a problem with him, I was always, like, ride or die for this guy. And um, it, it, so one of the main reasons I did this in particular was because, uh, now some of you who have been around for a really long time are going to remember this. Back in 2019, Seth and I had, like, a public uh, little, little beef, uh, little conflict when uh he uploaded his like itachi scale video and i uploaded my um uh itachi versus the five kage video right and um i was like so so if you guys don't remember or if you weren't there um seth then made a video on like his second channel with parrot and they they were pretty mean to me in the video and uh, i was just like what the fuck what like what what's going on and this turned into like a week maybe weekend long uh beef and um eventually at the end of it seth came to me and he was like look dude i'm so and i mean he was like he sounded real sorry really sorry like really really sorry and um like we called about it for like an hour and i was like i don't know because it was starting to get really personal um like it got way more personal than it needed to not just on seth's part there were other people involved who were doing all sorts of shit that they definitely shouldn't have um but seth like apologized to me and he was like yeah dude you know like seriously i feel really bad you know i've had this happen with people in the past i really don't want this to happen again and i was like yeah okay dude you know sure uh, i forgive you it's water under the bridge like that's normally all i need is an apology and like some closure on the situation so then you know, I find out from Clyde over the weekend, and as some of you guys are going to see in the video, uh, or maybe have seen, uh, that Seth has just not liked me, like, at all. It feels like, I mean, I, I don't want to speak for him, but it feels like he has not liked me, like, ever, right? And it was, like, way beyond the time that he gave me that apology. He was saying all this, like, horrible shit about me. Um, you know, like, uh, at least to Clyde, and I've also heard uh, to other people um then you know there was this other stuff with uh, i i don't want to mention other people's names um i, I don't want to sorry if it seems like i'm i'm only focusing on like the stuff that uh happened between seth and i personally like i'm not trying to be like um self-centered or whatever I'm, I'm just talking about like like i said i'm trying to like have some sort of structure to this whole thing right um the main thing that kicked this off was the you know the like thing that happened with uh one of my friends um, but then, like, finding out all of this stuff that, like, Seth, like, you know, had been saying about me and how he felt about me after he gave me what I thought was a very serious apology, I was just like, look, like, normally I would have just, like, accepted Seth apology. I, like, even considering some of the stuff is, like, like, really hardcore shit, like, to say about somebody, right? I was just like, you know, look, I, I would be willing to, like, accept this, right? Um, but like it's just i already went through this with him in 2019 and it was just kind of like bullshit and he was just like yeah so um you know i i'm just like uh, we talked about it right like i don't i don't want to get too deep into it and i was just like look you know like i i'm sorry but like this like i can't go through this a second time like you know the whole uh fool me twice shame on me thing right so i was just like i'm I, like at this point we we're just done uh talking to each other and working together and he was like yeah i understand so I'm not going to get much more into it than that. I'm not trying to completely grill him or whatever or, like, end his life. I told him because he said that he has, like, some personal issues that may have contributed to that shit. And I was like, look, genuinely, like, honestly, I hope that you can, like, fix that stuff and get to a point where you don't have to um, deal with any of that stuff anymore. Uh, I mean, like, I'm, I'm going to be completely honest, like, I used to have issues uh, when I was younger, like, that stuff that I, like, really hate about myself, uh, right, that uh, I thought that I just wasn't in control of, that I eventually got past and, you know, don't do anymore, so, like, I believe that Seth is, like, capable of improving and getting to a point where he doesn't do this type of thing to people, but, like, I was just like, look, like, you know, I'm not, like, this isn't, like, I'm not interested in going to war, we can keep all of the, like, 
collateral to like a bare minimum but i was just like yeah you know like i'm good i don't want to like interact uh anymore like i can't after this um of course there's like the other stuff um some of it is like he said she said ye uh so like i i don't know how much of it i should comment on like i don't i i'm like it's very difficult to figure out how to approach this because i like i'm not trying to be like toxic i'm not trying to be like bloodthirsty or anything i'm also not trying to cover for seth right like i, I am genuinely like really fucking upset about a lot of the stuff that was in that video and a lot of the stuff that wasn't even in that video that i found out uh about from clyde and some like other people but like it, it's just like like i'm not interested in making this like a, a spectacle if that makes sense you know like i don't know i'm trying to be like as uh reasonable about this as possible um while also doing like what's best for me right so um i also um like i don't know if there's like like what's going on with him and like other people or whatever but i mean so like as for like anybody else that's like connected to seth right um 